Hey guys, Thunder E here and welcome to another battle vid between the Galaxy S7 Edge in gold, the S6 Edge uh, in white, and the S6 Edge Plus, which is on the far right, in navy blue, or blue anyway. So these are Edge devices, they've got the Edge screen uh, functionality in some form or fashion, uh, but of course there are differences. So we'll start off with the S6 Edge that came out last year. Uh, it's 5.1 inch uh, display, QHD, it's got uh, Exynos processor, 4 gigs of RAM, uh, it's got quick charge 2.0, wireless charging built in there. Uh, it has a 16 megapixel camera, uh, no micro SD card expansion slot, of course, and of course, not the latest software uh, on there yet. Now, the S6 Edge Plus came out towards the end of last year. It's got a 5.7 inch QHD display. Otherwise, everything else is the same in specs as the smaller S6 Edge. It's just a larger version of that device, uh, which some people were clamoring for. So uh, Samsung went ahead this year and switched things up and released the Galaxy S7 Edge. At 5.5 inches, it comes in in between in size between both devices. It's got a smaller camera hump, and we'll talk about that in seconds, a 12 megapixel camera. Micro SD expansion is back with this. Quick Charge 3.0 is on this device. Uh, it's also got wireless charge in there, the, uh, the Snapdragon 820 processor in the US, 4 gigs of RAM and 32 gigabytes of internal storage. Now that camera hump is a 12 megapixel camera. It's actually a bigger lens uh, sensor size. It also takes in more low light, also double the micron size in terms of pixels, so which means better photos and also better autofocus. And that's something micro, uh, sorry, that's something Samsung uh, uh, detailed here. So basically uh, the idea is once you fire up the camera, you bring it uh, down, bring it up, it quickly focuses on your object and you can do that with ease and that's something that a lot of people like to take photos or want to see so you can bring it up and focus and it's right there it's also a water resistant device which means if you drop it in water if you dunk it uh, if you spill anything on it your device will still survive which is absolutely great so I'm glad that feature is back there now you've got the edge screen functionality now that has been expanded greatly you've got the people edge you've got a better widget section which gives you more information and more use I'm glad Samsung Samsung is improving the edge screen because I do like the edge devices. I think um, this is something that they can improve on and expand on and expand the way uh, smartphones are being used. That being said though, the full functionality here with more app, app uh, tray selection and just more functionality makes it stand out and gives it more useful feedback altogether. It's also got an always on display, which means that display uses minimal battery uh, power and displays a lot of information for you. So things like your time, your calendar, miss, messages, calls without actually turning on the full display. So since this is a simple AMOLED uh, QHD display, uh, you can see there it really shines, it, it really pops out as bright, but also battery use is minimal. Now the battery here is a 3600 milliamp battery. Yes, it is massive. And this device is also really light. So Samsung makes good use of the square area of the device with the battery placement. Uh, so this is not a heavy device. This is not something that's bulky. Trust me, when you lift it up, it actually feels really light in the hand. So I like that about the Galaxy S7 Edge. That being said though, those are all some of the features that really make this device stand out in terms of functionality here. Um, you've got, of course, the new Edge display functionality, always on display. You've got a better camera. Uh, you've also got uh, a, a, a new processor built into this. And also the sizing is also much more manageable at 5.5 inches instead of 5.7 from last year with the Edge Plus or 5.1 for me anyway. So guys, if you have any questions or any comment about our battle of it, let us know. Otherwise, don't forget to like and share this video. Check out our other videos from MWC and always enjoy your entertainment.